Good evening, Emmanuel Everywhere family. How y'all doing? I uh, firstly just want to thank you guys for those who uh, I, I really not a kind of person to kind of say everything that goes on with me. But a couple of weeks ago, <clears throat> excuse me, I had a throat surgery. And so I've been recovering from throat surgery and that's why you didn't hear me last week for Monday Night Live and I'll be really short tonight. Um, we have been in the Born series with our pastor and typically you know that our Monday Night Lives, we've been able to be intentional about figuring out how we go forward and what we should be doing during this week. Well, I think as we go into this week, um, and if you think about last week's message, peace is born. And this week's message, uh, hope is born. Um, they kind of go together. Hope and peace. Hope and peace. Um, I think it's, it's, it's clearly written in that scripture from Luke, the 14th verse of Luke chapter 2. The angels, the armies of heaven, praising God, saying, glory to God in the highest. Peace on earth with whom God is pleased. I think when we say that there is hope and peace, they kind of kind of go together. And so as pastor uh, spoke about that, about all that we've been waiting and looking for and hoping for is in Jesus, this baby. Reflect on your year. Reflect on the things that God has brought you through. Reflect on the things that you might still be in. Reflect on the fact that you're still here. Reflect on the fact that God is still on the throne, no matter the weather, no matter the climate, no matter the space that you're in, no matter uh, whether your job was doing great or whether you've had some difficulty, God has still been good. And as you get ready to go into this new year, Emmanuel everywhere, um, I just wanna be available to you for prayer, anything that you might need. Uh, many of you are on our stream and you are uh, without a church. And so I'm gonna be intentional as we go into this new year by reaching out to you personally to make sure that you are connected with our church in a way that we can be growing you and helping you along in this journey. And so all I wanna tell you guys, and I, and I wanna be short and brief, uh, I, I, I pray you continue to pray for me as I continue to get stronger. Um, the great thing about this particular voice surgery is I haven't been able to sing in a long time. I can sing again. And so I'm not going to try to sing now, but I can sing again. So I'm, I'm grateful for that. I hadn't been able to sing anything because of what was going on in my throat. But thank you guys for your prayers. And I, I appreciate your continued prayers. But most importantly, as you go into this new year, let it be reflection this week. Every day, you should be reflective of the journey and where God has taken you and what you're doing and what he what he's done. I mean, and, and, and where you're where you're growing. And then next year you go into it strong with the, with the faith and the hope that can only be found in Jesus who was born. And the peace that you can only have by a relationship with him. You do that and you're headed for a great beginning to a new year. God bless y'all tonight.